You feel that? What's your name? Isaac. Cyprus. So, Isaac, can you tell us what happened that afternoon? A meteorite with smoke trailing behind it appeared over the skies of Los Angeles yesterday. Isaac, where you been? You got a minute? I want to show you something. You're saying this is real. Are you okay? You leave me, right? Where have you been for the last few days? Yesterday? Yeah, yesterday, day before. I'm not making this up. This really happened to me. Okay. You've been gone from work all week. Did you have an encounter with an extraterrestrial being? How does it feel knowing that people are saying that you're a fake? Hi, Isaac. We have detained you against your will because we believe you have information that may be valuable to the future of our society. Keep running! When they come, we get one chance. Do you think that we were exposed to something that could have changed us? We have to be there when they come. That's a bad idea. That's way too dangerous. Do we really have another choice? I remember what it was like, and I'm not going through that again. Sarah! Why didn't you take us? Hey, it's Lisa with an interesting movie extras fact for Interstellar. Instead of developing a humanoid robot, Christopher Nolan conceived the idea for a quadlateral machine, one that would be able to divide and subdivide into smaller blocks. Nolan wanted the character to not only feel real, but be real. Therefore, he thought the best version of the character would be a practical build that would be puppeteered, and in post-production, they'd remove the puppeteering using CGI. Do you like my t-shirt? You can get one for yourself in the description. <laughs>